down on drones. Good evening once again. New regulations for drones, helicopters, and airplanes are already in place here in the U.S., but now even stricter rules are on the drawing board. So how much is too much? Tonight's 7 Eyewitness News reporter Ed Riley answers the regulation question. Still a thrill to see uh, an airplane flying and something that you're actually controlling. Bill Hoth has flown RC model airplanes for 36 years. He loves the hobby so much, it inspired him to get his private pilot's license. It's been a, a great part of my life. I've made so many friends. Hoth is also the regional associate vice president for the Academy of Model Aeronautics, or AMA, an organization with 15 local clubs and 200,000 members nationwide. The last thing I want to see is someone do something bad and wrong and put a bad name for the hobby. Advanced technology and cheaper prices have made it easy for more people to own unmanned aircraft systems, such as drones, airplanes, and helicopters. But that has led to problems with drones crashing into buildings, getting close to real aircraft, and leading to arrest for flying over sporting events. Some of these um, new rules and regulations are in place are for a handful of these people who are not following the rules. In response, the FAA now requires all amateur outdoor RC pilots to register, and the registration number must be on the outside side of the model. You cannot fly above 400 feet or near airports. And even if technology allows you to use cell phones or first-person view headsets, you must fly within line of sight and use a spotter. There are penalties uh, that, that are possible. Hoth and the AMA agree some rules are needed, but they worry the FAA is moving to even greater regulation this year. Another requirement will be a safety and knowledge test for recreational users. The RC pilots are now trying to increase awareness of flying rules while lobbying in Washington Washington to protect an educational hobby with an 80-year history. Kind of pushes people away from it, especially young kids. Uh, let's tread lightly. The Academy of Model Aeronautics has put together a lot of information so that you know before you fly. We put a link to that on our website so you don't fly yourself into trouble with the FAA. In Hamburg, Ed Riley, 7 Eyewitness News.